So this question says a moving truck can tow a trailer if the combined weight of the trailer and the boxes it contains is no more than 4,600 pounds. All right, so that sounds quite a bit like a translation. In fact, it's not even TWP. I'm just call it a translation question because those words can be directly translated into a mathematical equation, right? We do not know the weight of the trailer. I'll call it T. We do not know the weight of the boxes. I'll call that B. But we do know that when you add those two things together, that it should be no more than, which means less than or equal to, 4,600. So there's my translation of the first sentence. The next sentence says, what is the maximum number of boxes this truck can tow in a trailer with a weight of 500 pounds? Okay, so now we're told the T is 500 pounds if each box weighs 120 pounds. So B equals 120. Okay, so obviously I'm missing something here. So I should put an X here maybe because we have a single truck. That's our T, but we can have many boxes. So my X in front of my B value just represents, right? If I have one box, two boxes, three boxes is a variable, right? It's a variable number of boxes. So now that I have all this information translated from my question, I can plug in the details. So instead of T, I'm gonna call it 500. Plus, instead of x times b, I'm going to call that 120x. Again, x representing the number of boxes. Then I have less than or equal to 4,600. Now I just do my math, right? So subtract 500 from both sides of the equation. I'm left with 120x is less than or equal to 4,100. I'm going to divide both sides of my equation by 120. And I'm left with x is less than or equal to, go to my calculator, what is 4,100 divided by 120? Um, let's see, I typed that in wrong, divided by 120 equals, I'm getting 34.166 with a bar, which means that we should be, because we can't have decimal boxes, um, the largest value that uh, the number of boxes you can have is 34, right? So that's the maximum Ask for what is the maximum number of boxes. We can have a total of 34 boxes and still stay within our, our weight limitations. So answer choice A is correct.